Why do children align and reject? So this basically comes back to the principle that everything is polarity. So you have north and south, east and west, up and down, left and right. And in order to have that polarity, you have to have good and bad. So when you're aligning or rejecting, what you're basically doing is choosing what is good or bad. So there will be things that clearly go on in the background that will skew this judgment or potentially give you a certain sense of how you deal with people. And when it's your parents specifically, what you find is that half of you is one parent and half of you is the other parent. And because of that distinguishing factor of half of you is one and half is the other, then the question is, what is that dynamic? between those two people because that dynamic itself will teach you how you interact with yourself and then because you don't want to put yourself into any sort of level of danger or put yourself in an uncomfortable position because it's all about safety and security and what you're getting is you're getting a skewed judgment of yourself and a skewed perception of that self and then because you then have to survive in effect because potentially that relationship isn't ideal or it isn't brilliant then you're never taught that you have to obviously work on yourself and you have to get that connection with self and it's not based on that outside influence as to how you interact but because that doesn't exist from a place of emotional intelligence from an experience and from being taught at any sort of level then we have a position whereby we're getting to the point of you have to accept one and reject the other so that you feel most safe so whoever you've had the most time with or whoever you've built up the survival adaptation with then you're going to find that they are the most familiar and the most predictable and then what happens is because you've got the survival adaptation that makes them predictable and familiar then you will align with that person because of that negative association i.e this is what to expect this is what we get and the only thing is if this is as bad as it is then it can only get better whereas the person that you generally tend to reject will possibly be more positively orientated and then you have the inconsistency and the uncertainty around that fact that because they are positive it's like well when will it end is this true can this be a long-term setup and that lack of safety and security then means that you have to turn to something that then becomes more predictable. So that then becomes why you have an alignment and a rejection, because it's all to do with the individual's perceived level of perception of who they are and how they feel safe. Till next time, trust the process and it's bye for now.